back with VH Manufacturing here today to talk to you about our uh, Clark Cornheads, uh, specifically this 12 row 40 HB. This 12 row 40 HB is going out to Ben Simmons in Fairfield, North Carolina. Thanks, Ben, for your purchase and your trust in us making this cornhead for you. That being said, let's take a look around the cornhead and see some of the features of Clark Cornheads. First feature we'll get to is uh, our jackknife. Being that this is 40 inches row centers and Ben is on twin rows, um, we wanted to give him something that's really sturdy and uh, really convenient for him to work on. Um, so what you can do with these jackknives for storage and for when you're working on them, you lift up the snoop, sits in that hot there, and you've got all this free area down here to be able to work on. Um, it works nice for when you got to tension your chains, uh, if you got to change out some idler sprockets or some sprockets, chain guys, you know, whatever. And then uh, to put it back down, you simply lift it up, set it down, it'll get down underneath here, pull the teeth in, it'll drop down in and lock in so it's ready to go for out in the field. Um, next feature on this head is we have uh, header height control and row sense or auto steer. Um, Header height control is uh, controlled by these arms here. Uh, it's a ten uh, connected to a tensiometer and sends a, uh, a signal back to the box behind the head and into the combine. So then, as you go, it senses how high you are off the ground. So then we keep walking around here, then we get to our corn saver. Um, so this thing is really nice for if you're throwing ears. Um, and this, this is made for, we can sell it for uh, any corn head, um, but we put it on here because like we said, Ben's gonna be pulling in a lot of corn. Um, so we wanted to make sure that he had something here that uh, isn't gonna allow stuff to be flying out for him. Um, another feature of this corn head is hydraulic deck plates. And with those deck plates, we made them out of AR400. Um, AR400 is an abrasion resistance material, um, so it should stand up longer than any OEM deck plate. We also hard surface welded the edge, so these things should last quite a while. Um, this is the uh, auto steer or row sense. Um, as you're going through the field, it hits the rows and moves these things back and forth. And like the header height, there's a tensiometer in here that sends a signal back to the box and into the combine so then it can steer itself. Continuing down the corn head, um, we've got a uh, heavy duty auger in there. Um, that auger is made 100% in house here, right in Rock Valley, Iowa, BH Manufacturing. Um, yeah, we are able to make these for new corn heads and existing corn heads. So if you need a, an auger, give us a call. Going around the back side of the combine, we've got uh, an oil pan here, uh, made out of steel, sealed up nice, got oil inside there. That's all water there because it'll just power wash, it's not leaking oil or anything. Um, then we put these stainless steel fins on here. What, what, what we do with those stainless steel fins is when we're going through the cornfield and there are stalks here, we want to keep all that pressure away from this oil pan. This just kind of guides it away and it's stainless so it won't rust. It's a nice wear item so it shouldn't wear out. Stepping around the back side of the corn head, um, we've got a uh, auger slip clutch with a chain tensioner here. It's covered up by our nice bracket. Um, so, what you do is you loosen this bolt, you loosen this bolt, and then you can tension your chain as it starts to wear. Yep, much like that. We've got LED stubble lights for Ben for when he's working out at night. Um, that should work very well for him. Coming to the center of the corn head, this uh, corn head is going on a John Deere S790. Uh, so that's what this feeder house is built for. It can be built for a Case IH, um, Gloss, or uh, any other brand that you would have if you want this thing to go on. Um, continuing down, we've got our uh, single point
point hookup uh, for hydraulic deck plates and also uh, header height control and auto steer. This is uh, the head sight monitor right here. To be able to program it here. And then here is the uh, true sense, row sense, or auto steer, whatever word you want to use. So, and that is about it for this 12 row 40. Uh, thanks for watching.